Oh, lucky losers. Oh, lucky losers. Hi, I'm John, and welcome to Lucky Losers, the channel with content for all. And today it's all about this the Polish vodka crisis, or rather, this stuff. Yep. Because the situation isn't getting better, it is getting worse, and it's getting worse all the world over, as we're just about to find out. Lucky, lucky, Lou. Oh, lucky, Lou. It seems that in August, the month of sobriety for Christians, people are not drinking less or nothing, but drinking much more of the stuff. So, uh, this is an update to the situation in July. Um, uh, the data you'll see is from uh, the 18th of August. So, let's first of all look at, I hope you can see it, I'll draw it nearer and closer, the global situation. As you can see now there are over 22 million cases and that is up from last month um, and the increases are by the same percentages, something like uh, 40%. Uh, however the death rate is slowing, which is good news and the recovery rate is increasing. I hope you like this peg by the way. Um, let's have a look at the number of cases per country. Uh, USA is still on top with 5.6 million cases. That's a continual rise of 140%. Um, similarly in Brazil and India, sharp rises there. Um, interestingly enough, I've included the UK uh, just to demonstrate, the UK at the bottom here, just to demonstrate that uh, they've stopped, they've uh, almost stopped drinking the strong stuff. Um, in the country where I'm resident, the situation is on the increase. You know, in Poland, we do like vodka and likewise in Russia. So that's the number of cases per country. We'll now turn to the next statistic. Again, I hope you can see it. So how many people are dying from this lethal stuff? Um, again, USA on top. Uh, substantial increases in India. No idea why the stat in the UK is down from the 22nd of uh, July. Maybe they've dug up uh, 300 who are, who are actually alive. So I, maybe that's just seriously though. Maybe that's just an adjustment. Very slight increases in Italy where they prefer wine, but they did have a bash at the vodka big time. France are back in the top 10. And now we'll move on to the next statistic which we will look at and that is very important that is the active cases the actual numbers versus the number of cases in total again um, the US is continually high the percentage there in in the top four countries have all gone down the number of uh, active cases compared to the total cases so that's all been falling naturally we see in South America too in Colombia the situation in Peru is rather stable dead sharp drop in South Africa situations under control however in my country Poland uh, there has been an increase in the number of active, ca active cases versus the number of total cases. So we now move on to the next statistic, 
which is, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, falling forward, cases per million population. This gives us, this statistic gives us a truer figure. Um, as you can see, the Arab countries dominate and we've barely a European country here. If you want to include Armenia, that's the only European country we've, we've got there. It is in Europe, yeah. I think you, Armenia is technically, yes, they're in the European Championships, of course, they're in Europe. Sorry if you're Armenian. Um, there are naturally uh, increases all round in the number of cases per million. In India, there is a substantial increase uh, previously from 866 per million cases to over 2,000. That is substantial. That's more than the Czech Republic. San, San Marino is still tops there in that statistic. Now look at the number of deaths per million population uh, in Peru. That number has doubled. In the UK that's gone down and that is also due to that adjustment I was talking about earlier in the number of deaths. Maybe there's some error there. Maybe somebody there can put me right on that one. Uh, been a high rise in India. That's reflected also in the number of cases per million. When we talk about the number of deaths per million, we'll now come on to the next statistic, which is the total number of tests per million. Um, so the more tests, the more cases, especially if there are positive results. Um, and again, China suddenly had 90 million tests for the stuff. Um, I never thought they drank vodka in China. They're still way ahead. Substantial increase in the number of tests in the United States. In India, the number of tests has doubled. Uh, rises in Brazil, substantial rises all told there. And we'll now move on to the next statistic. Total tests per million population. Uh, the Arab countries dominating there. As we can see at the top, United Arab Emirates with Bahrain. Interestingly enough, in India, a very low number of tests. I hope you can see the bottom of that. Just adjust, there we go, the camera a little bit. Sorry, Union Jack. Um, San Marino, uh, India's low on 22 there per million population. And finally, we've got a new table here. These are projections of the number of deaths. Uh, what uh, the World Health Organization actually forecasts uh, for December. What's going to be th their projection for the number of deaths. Interestingly enough, there's no data for India here. So anyone, rather it's anyone's guess what that number could be. There are substantial increases in uh, Mexico of over 200%. In all cases, uh, there are many over 50% projections. In Poland, 391%. So they reckon Poland's gonna be drinking a lot more vodka in the coming months there. In Russia too, but naturally, I think they're the kings. Well, Czechia, that's interesting, I don't know uh, that's the projection they showed me, the 5,829 cases, uh, death cases. Uh, why such an increase, I don't know. Maybe there's some kind of mistake. Maybe I'll keep an eye on that uh, for next month, see if there's any changes when I do my uh, September update. Um, we'll keep an eye on that, as I've said there. So that brings the video to a close the update on the Polish vodka crisis. I hope you found it interesting. Um, so be careful how you go with this stuff. Keep an eye on everything. And I'll make an update with you in September, precisely or approximately rather a month's time. That'll be just uh, before my birthday, if I'm still here. Um, wasn't a joke and yeah I'll love you and leave you and don't forget to follow all other videos on my channel uh, it's about everything it's content for all 
Um, whatever you're interested in, I'm sure you'll find something in my videos about that. So I'm gonna love you and leave you until next time. Bye. And don't forget to subscribe. Lucky losers. Oh, lucky losers, oh, lucky losers. Lucky, lucky, lucky loo. Oh, lucky losers, oh, lucky losers. Lucky, lucky, lucky loo. Oh, lucky losers, oh, lucky losers. Lucky, lucky, lucky loo. Oh, lucky losers, oh, lucky losers.